going on ladies and gentlemen this is Jacob from JC TechSpot and today I'm actually going to be showing you guys the new updated version on how to get an iOS screen recorder. Um, I know a lot of you guys have been complaining about how the Air Shower version that I showed a couple weeks ago in a video crashed. Uh, it does crash a lot. I will admit when they try to update the app Air Shower it will crash. Uh, but there is another option for you that a lot of people do not know about. And this is simple, an app store application that I'll be showing you guys how to use today. So uh, thank you guys for watching and let's get right to it. Either way, so um, of course it's just this app right here, Pro Recorder. You may see it next to my shower.tv app. And it's uh, pretty simple, so you're just going to want to go to the app store. And what you're going to type in is... Uh, you're not going to type in Pro Recorder because I know on some devices if you type in Pro Recorder, it doesn't pop up. So you're going to want to type in shower actually because it does uh, have the talent to type in shower with broadcasting because this Pro Recorder app, why is my app store not loading? 2,000 years late. Yep. Alright, so we're going to type in S-H-O-U and we're just going to type in shower. So it won't be the first option, it's going to be one of the, either the second or third. Yep, right here. So. It should be if you're, uh, I'm on iPad only, but if I change it to iPhone only, let's see where it is. Sorry about the word. It's still the third thing. So it should be the third thing either way. And it's uh, called Pro Recorder. And that is basically an app that you can use to record your screen and broadcast. Um, now I don't, it's not as good audio as Xiao is, but it still works. And so it should look like this. Let me just go and open it up for you guys. Pro Recorder. And this should be the screen that pops up right here. Unfortunately, this does have a lot of ads. That's the only bad thing about it. Um, all you do is you hit this record video button or record web screen. And if you hit record web screen, that's the one that actually records your screen. And uh, once you're finished recording, you just go to recorded file and they should pop up here. I haven't used it yet, but uh, I've deleted the files that I have used. It works pretty well. Um, it's not as good quality as Xiao is, but uh, you can also record just your voice, you can record a video, or you can input a video from your camera roll to actually insert to the cloud. So it's really useful. This one does have a, a good couple more features than Xiao actually does. But uh, either way guys, I do know that Xiao has been crashing a lot, especially with the new iOS 9.2.1 update. It is not quite compatible yet. Um, and so Xiao is working very hard to update Xiao for 9.2.1 and future Apple versions. But just if you guys, if you really still want to re screen record, you can just use this little pro recorder app right here. It's very simple. Uh, once again, guys, this is Jacob from JC TechSpot. Uh, thank you guys for watching.